Hello everyone. Happy Friday. Hopefully everyone can see and hear me and things run smoothly. We have more cat shaking today, as we've seen in the comments and chat. It's like uh, we got a couple people here. Let's see who we got. Hey Casey, one of our wonderful moderators. Give her a big thank you if you haven't done so already. We have Ash of Yahoo. Hey Sammy. Hey Mira. Be sure to check out Simply Sammy's channel. She has a YouTube channel as well. I think I just said hey Mira, but if not, you get a hey twice. Hey Kelly. And hey Toby. Toby also has a new YouTube channel. You should check that out as well. All right, so we are continuing calico today and more more cat shaking more tipsy riding more you know construction cats and all that stupid stuff it's gonna be great but i hope everyone is having a good friday or as good as you can i know like sifting through the chat skimming through the chat some people uh are not having the best day or the best week but hopefully we can make things better in our stream, at least if it's just a fun distraction where we can go to a world of wonderful animals and not have to worry about everything, anything else for the next couple hours. So hopefully this can be a nice way to, you know, wrap up your week, start your Saturday morning, wherever you may be coming from. But without further ado, we can just jump right in. And yeah, hopefully a few more people will trickle in as we go, and like Casey said, give that a like button and hit that subscribe button and the bell and all that fun stuff. Feeds the algorithm, feeds me and Tipsy. Alright. Okay. That's what we have going on right now. I'm holding a polar bear as we come back. If I put you down. Okay. Where is Tipsy? We need to ride Tipsy. Attend the Owl Club meetings. I have to get reacclimated to how to actually play this game and where and what I need to do. Let's see. Inventory. Animals. Tipsy! How do I call you? Oops. Don't want to change your name. Okay. Way to signal them, I don't remember. <laughs> okay. Let's just uh, exit out of that. If I can figure that out. Okay. Um, we got some wolf, a deer. It's beautiful. Oh, there you are, Tipsy. I don't even need to call you. Here we go. Riding that cat. Tipsy doesn't even need a saddle. That's a savvy cat. Absolutely. She's talented. She has many cat ears to go with her regular cat ears. And I guess the red box is following us and this little dude. <laughs> yes, thank you uh, for sharing the Patreon, Casey. Do you have a Patreon page where we have a a lovely little Discord community attached as one of the tiers or perks for joining. Oh. Oh, thank you so much, Sammy. Thank you for the wonderful super chat. Wanted to pay my rent for hanging out. <laughs> you don't you don't owe any rent for hanging out. I always appreciate when you're here. I love you too. Oh. Hi there. I do not remember how to play this stupid game. Um, okay, it's like, are you gonna let me talk to you? Ooh. Oh, you! Oh yeah, you're an owl. I forgot about that. It's nice to have visitors up here. You're doing well? Everything is fine. It's about Maya. I miss her and I'm feeling guilty about not getting out to visit her. It's okay. hoping you might be able to figure out. Of course, I got nothing better to do. Let me do all your tasks and save the cat town for everyone. 
But I want to ask if you could deliver her some fresh baked donuts. Nothing would make me happier. They are absolute favorite. Hmm. Would you mind? No problem is my only choice. What if I do mind? Hey, Freya. Hey, Obsidian, Obsidian. Meow. Catch up with you later. Okay, what am I doing? And the Owl Club meetings at Freya's house. How do I do any of this? Okay, Freya's house is up there, so that's where we're gonna go. TFC, where'd you go? Yep. Meow. Oh. Meow. Nope. Okay. How do we call pets? I don't remember how to do that. Nope. Not that button. Animals. Animals. Status. Okay. Can we, like, move you to my party? Oh yeah, that's how you do it. That's right. Where are you, Tipsy? Are you here? Alright, love that red panda. Yes, that's a red panda. My brain kept thinking it was like a fox. That's right. <laughs> I'm so smart. This game is wild in the eye. <laughs> it's a very strange game for sure. Hey, Hustle Fudge. Glad you can make it. You gonna you gonna join us, Tipsy? Oh, there you are. Okay, S sorry, Red Panda, you're demoted. Tipsy always takes precedence. We now we're gonna go talk to the owl people. Oh, hello, Capybara. You are smart. Oh, thanks, Toby. Hey, Tori. I'm not, like, super smart when it comes to animal stuff. Maybe a few other areas. Alright, we're gonna talk. Attend the Owl Club meeting. Nothing would make me happier. By that I mean an Owl Club meeting does not pique my interest at all. Hi. It'll be nice when we get the beach open again. Have you heard about the poison flowers there? Oh, I probably need to get the other person. First order of business is accepting our new member. All in favor? Yee. 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 Ye. Okay. Yee. <laughs> the yees have it. Welcome to the owl club. Hoot hoot. I guess I'm an owl now. How exciting. Owl human hybrid. Red panda is close enough to a cat. I can work with that. Yeah. They're all cats. Just, you know, different versions of cats. Now on to our second issue. A crew of construction cats. Ah, oh, we're finally get getting to that. Have blocked off the road in the city and we can't get them to budge. Newest member. I have a name. What happened when you talked to them? Meow, meow, meow. That doesn't make sense. Of course it doesn't. Road construction is an ancient art shrouded in mystery. You heard it, folks. <laughs> Uh-oh. I meant they just said soft paws hat soup. Wait, as you speak cat? <laughs> well, yeah, speaking cat is a first year witch school stuff. Oh, I want to learn how to speak cat. And wonder all the amazing things that Tipsy says to me. Well, then we have our translator. Let's go have a construction, constructive cat chat. Owl club field trip time. And they're off. They, I forgot how weird the character movements in this game are. Because that's how I run, with my arms out in front of me like this the entire time. The clinic we're rehabbing a great horned owl that fell into a grease trap. Oh. Oh, poor owl. Like Priscilla the Crossbreed in Dark Souls. Is that what we're talking about when we mention half owl? Sure. 
and go right to Dark Souls. <laughs> and I've gotten a few people requesting Dark Souls. Maybe one day we can play a super difficult game. I mean, I guess we've played Celeste, but we can do something like that. <laughs> we need to cross over with the construction cat and platelets from cells at work. Meow. Meow, 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 meow. Meow, meow, moo. Mur. Anybody understand what the cats are saying? Meow. Meow, meow, mew. Meow. All right. Profound. I know the, all the secrets. They're the answer to the meaning of life now. Tell me. They said they need bagel energy to finish the construction. Of course they do. They're deficient in vitamin bagel. Oh, I got money. Cool, somebody came to my cafe. I'm assuming that's what that pop-up means, because I've never seen that. Vitamin bagel. Not familiar with that one. You're in the cafe, right? If you make make up some bagels, we could clear out these construction cats, and you'd have new customers, too. Of course, I gotta buy your recipe. Hoot hoot. Alright, Tipsy. Let's go. Let's go. Compared to Celeste, I guess, Dark Souls. No, never mind. <laughs> Dark Souls is a different kind of challenge, I guess we could say. I think I find uh, Celeste more frustrating than Dark Souls. Yeah, maybe I could play Dark Souls 3, because I never beat Dark Souls 3. We could create a new character together, and it will be a disaster. Of course I understand. I speak cat, but we are in polite company. <laughs> Okay, the general store, if I remember correctly. Hmm. This is so much more peaceful than playing Celeste. <laughs> oh, can I run? Can you run faster? What is the speed button that's... Okay, which one's the general store? Oh, what is that green creature up there? Oh, is it that weird green bunny again? map. Community general store. Estelle's general store. Oh, it's the other cat. So I guess it's this one. I guess I could just try. There's not many places to go. Bagel. Did I already buy this? I don't remember. Spooky dresser. Cute table. Are the legs like cat paws? Alright, let's buy one. Okay. Spooky dresser. No, I don't want to waste my money on that. I mean, everything in this game is a waste of money, so it's fine. And now we're writing, uh, what's this, what's this, uh, panda's name? Patches? Patches. Rusty, yeah, patches. Cute. That's a big cat. <laughs> hey, Mikey. So, sounds like Casey wants a bagel. Does everybody want a bagel? Some of that vitamin bagel, according to, uh... I think the character was Ash that said that. <laughs> okay, so now we're gonna do the... Oh, polar bear breaking free. Maybe I'll ride the wolf next. Let everybody have some fun. Oh wow, people are actually in my cafe. That's exciting. It's like, my business is actually making money. Oh, we got lyrics. Make food. Don't let anyone say it. I can be a cheap date when I'm eating these. Can't be a cheap date when I'm eating pizza rolls and Arizona green tea. Solid. I love it. Oh, I can make flan now. Complete with a cat face. Um... So Let's make some flan. Milk, sugar, and egg. 
Can anybody else cook like this? There we go. Of course I missed. <laughs> Gross clone. I feel like we, we talked about that last time that uh some of us are not fans of clone. Single egg that I can't get to. And throw that egg. And milk. You milk, yep. I can read, it says milk. Okay, that cat is terrifyingly big. Yay! You want some flan, cat? Here you go. You're in my way. Okay, now we're gonna make a bagel. Proportions of this game are so wacky. <laughs> Absolutely. It's like I can shrink, the animals can grow. It's great. Nothing makes sense. But everything is delightful. Okay, we got some salt. Okay, and cream, uh, butter. So we need a whole stick of butter, a whole bag of sugar, a whole bag of salt to make a single... Oh, the butter's still counting on that list, so that's fine. It's gonna be one powerful bagel. Yay! Complete with cream cheese already in it. Okay. How do we... what do we do now? What do we do now? Um, tell the construction cats the cafe has bagels, so I have to go back to them. How do I change what's in the, uh, I don't know how to play. Um, uh, talk to Sunny, put a piece of cloud furniture in the cafe, deliver some donuts to my, I don't have donuts. Hmm. Inventory. I don't remember how to do any of this. Spooky carpet. Okay, we're done. Um, okay, so how do I, do I do it with the book? Make food. Ah, there we go. Uh, let's see. Display cans. I'll put a, a bagel. Bagel in there. Maybe uh, put a cup of coffee in the display case. Hopefully it doesn't get cold. And some flan, just for Toby. We got bagels. Oh, Jesus. There's a lot going on there. Alright, friend. You're my new steed. Hey, Bulan. Hey, Fade Lemonade. Making sure I'm saying that right. Did that dog step into it like it did with the can and with the flan. Hmm, think I missed something there. <laughs> Alright, tell the construction cats the cafe has bagels. Alright, cats. Meow, meow, meow. Translation Bagels. Meow. Cat bagels meow, at the meow. cafe. Meow, meow, meow. Yay. Oh, sorry. Did not mean to do that. Wrong button. Oh my god, that's adorable. 
Vitamin bagel coming up. So it looks like we unlocked a whole new area. How fascinating. What the hell do we do now? Okay. I said I unlocked a new style. Is that like my my clothes? My clothes, my No. I don't know. Save and exit. Complete with my tacky outfit. Okay. Oh, we got we got oh we got a bunch of cats just walking around like people. This is normal. It's kind of weird. Look at that! Look at that cat. Oh, a human. Oh, a giant bird. Let's go. Can we ride you? Let's see. Hold to wiggle. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Shake the bird. Alright. Oh, kitty's bought bagels. <coughs> Here we go. This is what y'all were waiting for. Shaking cats. Equipped with funky cat city music too, yeah. <laughs> and the music is done. Alright. <coughs> oh. Tipsy's too big to shake. Sorry, Tipsy. Howdy there, I'm Malcolm. I do Malcolm things in a Malcolm way. That means absolutely nothing to me. Could use someone to talk through something with, actually. It's like, why are there so many cats here and no humans? Here's what's up. There's a big dance competition to happen in the city next week, and your voice is grating. I've been seeing posters for it all around town. First, I was so excited. I love dancing. Perfect opportunity for me to show that off. But, what's wrong? I'm really nervous. Oh, look at those like, little rainbow socks or shoes or whatever those are. They're gonna be a lot of really talented cats competing. And cats are super nimble and flexible. The city is teeming over with amazing dancers. Cat dancers? Shaking the cat like it owes you money. <laughs> what if I just embarrass myself? I'm sure you won't embarrass yourself. That's not helpful. What would make you feel more confident? I don't know, do you think you should give me some feedback on my dance moves? Sure, it's gonna suck. <laughs> Ugh. Ugh. Dancer can't have only one. Oh, you need three options. Okay. Sure. Don't know how I'm supposed to react. Very cool. Dancer can't have only one move. So, I don't have a choice here, because you need three moves, and... Why, why is this, why is this a thing? There we go, that's the winner. That's awful. It's so cringy. <laughs> yeah, you look ridiculous, that's the point. Wow, hearing you say that makes me feel a lot more confident. Yeah, stranger complimented, complimented my dance moves. I got all the confidence I need. So now I know what move I'm going with, that's one step. Now I just need to practice endlessly. Good luck. A design. Hmm. What do we got going on here? This is weird. Tipsy is asserting her dominance. Oh, I thought I was going to be riding Tipsy there. Interesting. Okay. Here we go, Tipsy. What are we supposed to do now? We made it to the city. What do we do? What do we do? Oh, we're good. I'm here. Trixie. Oh, that's cute. Let's give you a giant potion. Okay. Animal command. Follow me. <laughs> Hudgems. Okay, Heart Village. Snowfall Mountains. Wow, a cutie city. That's where we're at now. Fun. Okay, so let's get Trixie up 
fun accessory. I only have cat ears. Wow. How do I make you giant? Since that's the most important thing. Use potion on. Here we go. Woo! We have a giant trash panda. And trash cans perfectly placed. No idea what the hell I'm supposed to be doing. Okay, another weird person. Let's go talk. Hello. Hello, good person with your magical sparkly cape. Ooh, I want that. Can I have it? Can I steal it from you? Have you seen a dragon around here? So we're gonna have dragons? I don't currently know where that situation is, but sure, whatever it is, it's under control. I'm Steve. Thanks, Steve. Hey, it's you. Do you like cute things? Yeah, who doesn't? Experiment with new potion is supposed to clean furniture. Oh. Stella and I have been talking about something like that for a while, but it turns out more complicated than you think. We made magical cleaning solution. Magical Windex. Here we come. Magical Lysol. Okay, okay, maybe the reason I never finish the cleaning potion is I always get sucked into working on something more fun instead. Cutie City Cutification Potion. In this game, to qualify what we mean when we say girl what's shaken. <laughs> Absolutely. I hope we can get a dragon, that'd be cool. I want to ride it. Yeah, I don't think they let your... I don't know if they let you ride birds in this game, but does a dragon count as a flying creature or land creature? Okay, I'm not really listening to what you say right now. I'm curious to see how the potion works on display cases, since you were on one in the cafe. Can you bring me a basic display case to test the potion on? Sure, nothing would make me happy. Oh, sorry about that. Well. Got another construction kitty. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Can't let you through official orders from the city. Got a mess of poisonous flowers. <laughs> Nobody's going until they're taken care of. The beach is off limits. Ask around the city to find a solution. I guess that's our next quest. <laughs> Safety cat. Oh. For half a second, I thought I was just going to like suffocate and die. But nope, I just can't move past it. Let's go to the Ferris wheel. This island feels kind of empty and sad. Hey, Zoe. Another one of our amazing moderators. Show her some love. Ride the Ferris wheel. Must ride Ferris wheel. Yeah. Nope. A little too, a little too... A little too eager. Here we go. This is fun. This is what all y'all came for, right? And just, uh, sit here. Cool. Fascinating. We get to the top, we jump. Theo Masarda, the fluffy sea. Sealgasus? Hello. Probably mispronounced that, and I apologize. And here we go. Whee! Okay, we need to we need to find find some information. So we got cats and other cats. What's your name? Miss Kitty. Oh, that's terrifying. Move. You're in my way. I'm trying to pick up Miss Kitty. Woo! Hello, Miss Kitty. Wiggle, wiggle. This is all we need in our lives. Cat wiggles. You're coming with me. Party is full. The fuck? You're going to the cafe. This is the worst arcade ever. I can't play any of the games. Ugh. Anyone else's stomach flip while falling in games? Yep, 
Mine does a little bit. <laughs> it's easier to do it in a game like this where it's like, I will not be, I will not get hurt by it. <laughs> Okay, is there any one of these cats I can talk to? Kitty, kitty, kitty. Oh, looks like we got a little, little cat party over here. Hmm, somebody has their little cat minions. Hello. Can I join? Oh, they have little ties. Look at that. Kind of staring at me like it wants to kill me. Are you my three o'clock meeting? No, how rude of me. I am Safina, CFO of Cat Core. Look at that. I want to be CFO of Cat Core. My assistant told me that the Heart Village Cafe was reopening under new ownership. So glad we were able to connect. I never thought about opening a franchise of cat cafes. Whoa, hold on. I just opened my first one yesterday. Merchandise, children's cartoon. I mean, cat videos. That's all we need. Cat CEOs, yes. What a beautiful world. Can you ride a red panda? I can ride a red panda. I'll do that next. <laughs> Got my own little entourage. Do some outside perspective. We're just saying. Boss cat. <laughs> Heard the Golden Grove is lovely this time of year, and so much quieter in the city. Business Cat won. Um, isn't there a giant monster living in the Golden Grove? Uh, do you really believe such a silly rumor? What if we got a cabin in the mountains? We could spend every day at the hot springs. Business Cat too. The hot springs? With my coworkers? Like, taking my tie off in front of you all? <laughs> no way. Too shy for that. What about the Witching Woods? Sounds like they agree on absolutely nothing. They say there's wild catnip growing as far as the eye can see. <laughs> Business Cat 3, I'm not going to the Witching Woods. I heard there are giant plants that eat cats. How about a house in Heart Village? It's so quaint and cozy and I heard the cat cafe just opened. Best cat cafe on the island. I'm not biased. Last time I went to the cat cafe, I made a complete fool of myself. I'll never live those pictures down. Ah, staycation it is. We're so often blind to the beauty and culture all around us. And blind to the beauty and culture we could be binge watching on TV. What is happening? This conversation is a staycation. If we want to spend the week in the city not getting any work done, we'll just keep this conversation going. Clover Coast. It's quiet, scenic beach activities, taking ties off is optional. Clover Coast is perfect. The cat voices are so strange. But all of Clover Coast is off limits. An invasive species of toxic flowers has taken over. Oh my, that's awful. Made my decision. It's the largest company on the island is our social responsibility to revitalize this public space. All right, mission accomplished. You, the one that's not a cat as far as I know. Meow. <laughs> How would you like, oh, of course I have to do it. How would you like to work for us as a temporary consultant? Your goal is to make the beach safe again. I was going to do that anyway. I suggest you start by finding a flower expert. If you need help, you have all of Cat Corporation's resources at your disposal. Okay. What now? Find a flower expert. Okay. I guess that's what we're doing. Um... Who would be the expert of flowers? Probably Poppy, considering Steve's tower. <laughs> oh, there's a couple people here that I have not talked to yet. Let's go talk to them. All right, Red Panda, let's see, which one am I getting? Which one am I getting? Oh my, uh, okay. Had to go up Red Panda's butt to get on top of uh, the wonderful Trixie raccoon. That's adorable. Very witchy. <laughs> I don't know if anyone is interested, but I have a split ton. I am very. Mm. Alright. 
that's happening in our conversation. Oh my gosh, hello. So excited to see a new person in town. I heard you're opening up the cafe again, and I'm so excited. Liz, save something sweet for me. Okay. Oh my gosh, hi. Glad I caught you out here. I wanted to ask about your cafe. What is it? Could you maybe get more kinds of chairs? A little variety never hurts. Well, jeez, you haven't even been yet. What's comfy for one person is bad for another. At least three different kinds of chair in your cafe. Sure, whatever you say, stranger. You know better, even though you've never been to the damn cafe. Hello, friend. Hey, wait a second, you're new. I'm Lee, we should be friends. We're friends now. That's how it works. You cleared the way to Heart Village. Maribel's fashion store is the best. We should hang out there sometime. Okay. Investigating butts now, apparently. Okay. Okay. Hey, it's you. It's me. It's a little embarrassing to know it's a secret, but I know you're trustworthy. Okay. You know Maribel's birthday is coming up? She hangs out with me in the arcade sometimes, and last we were there, in there, saw her eyeing the cute new bunny rabbit plushie that just got added to the claw machine. I'd be able to get her, but that machine is impossible. Also, the arcade machines do work. Is that what I'm gonna do? Think you can let me- Oh, I wanted to play it. Beans. Sure. Thanks. Okay. Fine. I would much rather waste like a thousand and get to play it myself. Boo. Oh, oh, you can climb that. Oh, maybe, maybe not. Maybe not. Oh, there we go. Okay, so we got this highway. Hey, Coco and T. So happy to catch you live. I love your channel and you're such an inspiration. We recently started HRT T and coming out to everyone who helps to see. Aw. So happy to meet you virtually. Glad you can make it to a live stream. Bunnies everywhere. Okay, where am I going? Flower shop. Give me your flowers. Hey there, flower friend. What's for sale? Oh, need anything? Actually, yes. Uh, no, I need something from you. I was supposed to go and meet... How do you say that? Shin? Today? The mushroom? Yeah, I met her. She's been telling me. The Skyrim that tracked accidental bunny deaths. Oh god. is one of the greatest online trans groups I've seen. Aw, that's awesome. I love hearing that. We need more people to come. And keep growing the wonderful family. Hmm, okay. Tell me all about the different kinds of edible mushrooms that grow in the deep woods. Over a hundred species. Okay. Got super busy, spiral out of control, grab the spores, sort of thing. Hey there, flower friend. Mm -hmm. Ooh, a citrus coffee table. I do need new coffee tables. Succulent. That's a chair. Perfect. Make somebody sit on the succulent. It'll be so uncomfortable. I'm a flower expert. I mean, who else would be the flower expert here? Would you be the flower expert? Tell me about your flowers. That's awkward. What's the story, Morning? Oh, can you not do that motion, please? 
<laughs> well, sorry, y'all. Or maybe I'm not sorry. I guess I encountered that myself recently. Clover Coast used to be one of my favorite napping spots. I want to grab a few new flowers. Can you clear the poison flowers? I'd love to. They wouldn't let me in. Said it was too dangerous. And showed them my badge to prove my flower authority. <laughs> they said my badge was just a flower in my lapel. I said, exactly. <laughs> you could try appealing to Marikiba, though. She doesn't do much ordering around. But she technically is in charge. All right, let's go talk to the mirror. Let's check to the mirror. We're gonna go do some mayoral stuff. Okay. Sorry, Patches. I'm biased. Gotta go back to Queen Tipperton. Okay. Map. Of a mayor. Well, there's the mayor's house. There's nobody around. Mayor! Oh, there you are. Playing. There's so many different colored bunnies. Bunny! Bunny! Hello. Hey, friendo! Legal crimes. <laughs> When it's time for it, it'll happen. Lots of hurdles in transition, but when we get through, it is a miracle. It absolutely is. The thing I hate is I would be publishing it in the newspaper. Oh. Yeah, I know some places have to do that. Poison flowers. So beautiful. So dangerous. So like us. I'm sorry, friend, but it's far too risky for you to handle them. Poppy sent me, Poppy sent me, Poppy sent me. Yes. The father of flowers himself. Well, of course I trust Poppy. He's the one that identified the flowers in the first place. I mean, he is the flower expert after all. Be a huge project, and the island is all out of public funds right now. Maybe we could do a fundraiser. Bake sale. A pet wash. Cat Corporation also sent me. Corporation of Cats itself? Well, if they're footing the bill, well, then what are we waiting for? Go tell Poppy to start right away. Ugh. So now I gotta go back. Like, can't we just invent, like, a cat cell phone so I don't have to run around? Alright, Poppy. Yeah, here I am complaining. It's, like, two steps away. Okay, I'm gonna stand in a different position. Good to go. It's great news. Why don't you call a day, get some rest, I'll have these poisonous flowers gone before sunrise. Well, that's nice. I like going to sleep and my problems are gone when I wake up. If only life was like that in actuality. Do you have any experience tips for name change? Things have changed. Yeah, I think where I live it has to be a big newspaper. Yeah, I can't speak to having to put it in a newspaper, but I know one thing that was very helpful for me and a lot of people where I live, well, I mean, I did a lot of my own and then it was helpful for other people, but we had, um, there was a legal service in town that helped with name changes and they even did workshops for free for community members. So, I mean, that would probably be one suggestion is if you need any help with the process, seeing if there's like any legal teams that are doing workshops or partner with a community group to nicely encourage them to do one. Because the process is super confusing and it's, you know, it's at least slightly different in like every single state, even every county. Yeah, if you're, I don't know where you are, obviously, but I mean, if you're in a more progressive area, then you might, it might be easier to find a place that will do that. But yeah, that was probably the best resource where I was in uh, Florida at the time when I changed my name. My girlfriend's name is Chloe, so this feels awkward somehow. Oh, 
I mean, Chloe's are great, so good choice. So we need to put three kinds of tables. I have three kinds of tables. Can you not stand on the furniture, please, Miss Kitty? Yeah. Oh, cool. You're just going to go on another piece of furniture. Okay. How do I decorate? Inventory. Uh, basic. Just like me. Holy shit, that's big. I'll put you outside. How do I rotate you? Here we go. We got a cat. Tree. Okay, perfect. Look at that. Everybody's happy now. Does my ma ma Mr. Claw Arrow really have to go up the stairs? I can't go through the wall. Other things like birth certificates are another matter. Yes. Yes, that can be either very easy or outright impossible, depending on the state. Cute table. Hmm. I feel like I'm not wisely using the floor space here. Do, 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 do. Yeah, we have a table and spooky carpet. Oh, you're big. This is the entrance to the shop. Perfect. Flower table. That, that looks highly impractical. Ah, uh, succulent chair. Speaking of impractical. <laughs> Clearly I am uh, not an expert at interior design. Just put everything wherever the fuck I want to. Here we go. This, this looks exactly where you should put this table. Perfect. Maybe we can... I pick this up. Whoever's making that noise, it's horrifying. It's probably the bear. Basic garden table. Do you want the garden table? Oh my god, can you stop? There we go. Garden. Do I got any chairs left? Basic trash. Oh yeah, we got a rad chair for this rad table. Perfect. Rad partition. A rad... Ooh, that is cool. I don't even know when the hell I got that. Mm, that bear just looked like it was scooting its ass on the grass. Gross. Okay, so we got some red cat trees. This doesn't even look like a cat tree. Let's put this at uh, the edge of the stairs where it's nice and in the way. Perfect. Everybody likes a little bit of privacy. There we go. A little bit, a little bit of privacy. Okay, how do I come back? How do I turn back into a human? Choose color. Okay. How do I come back? How do I come back? Oh, there we go. I am human again. All right, weird ass bear. Right. No, I don't like your noises. Alright, anybody else want to go on an adventure? Snow day potion, start or stop snow? I don't even know when the hell I got that. How exciting! <coughs> Chloe, do you have a Discord group for your fan base? I do. It's actually through the Patreon. I think 
Casey put it somewhere in the chat, and there's also should be a link in the description. And we do, I do it through the Patreon just to add an extra level of a uh, security, I guess, to help prevent, you know, hopefully prevent as much as possible, like any trolls from getting in. That bear is threatening. Good security. Yes. Oh my goodness. We get hello there. It's nice we get the meat job and have here. There's poison flowers here. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Uh Um Legends. Would you like to join my party? Tiger. Uh, I'm gonna send you back to the camp, eh? And we're gonna have Pedjams. Come on, Pedjams. Are you Pudgems? Are you Pudgems? No, you're Tiger. No, you're Pudgems. Oh, you're a you're a beefy cat. <laughs> Look at that face. So cute. So next up. Giant Pudgems. Holy shit, you're big. Well, I think we found the biggest animal so far. God, that tail could kill somebody. Is there a love button in this game? There should be. This cat is obnoxiously big. Felsafina and the business cats that Clover Coast is safe. Yay! The bear needs a leather and harness. Hmm. I'm sure, well maybe, that is an unlockable item at some point. Okay, where are we going? Oh yes, to the uh, CFO of Catcore. This music is obnoxious. Oh yeah, I'm supposed to talk to you about something. Some about 100 species of toxic mushrooms that'll kill everything. Spores for Lily. Yes, I have them right here. She asked me, I said, sorry, she couldn't make it herself. I actually thought this might happen. Blah, 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 blah. Write up some instructions. Give her these two. Okay. Oh my gosh, hi. You got the chairs? That's great. Can't wait. Actually found a couple more chairs. Ooh, another. Why stop at five? Why not keep going? Infinite chairs. I don't think I have space for that. Oh, Jesus. Where are we going now? Oh, we're going to the... Oh yeah, we still need to talk to that person. Hello, cat business. Business, business, business. How's business? Clover Coast is open. Investing in friendships always pays dividends. Yeah, very transactional of you. Here's your payment. Thanks. I'm gonna swim in the ocean. I don't even care if something icky touches my foot. I'm gonna roll in the flowers until I smell nice. Oh, that's cute. I'm gonna bury myself in sand. I'm gonna read some books. You do you, business cat. I'm gonna nap in the sun for a week straight. Mm, that. Ooh, how do? What do I do with these designs? Oh my God! Look at them go. They're so cute. All right, Pudgems. So there's like designs. How do? What do? What do I? What do I? What do I do? I wear a monocle. That's what I do. Nope. Do not want virtual facial hair. Don't want real facial hair. I don't want virtual facial hair. Okay, I don't understand this game. Here we go. Unanimous vote. Love passing. Says you, Sammy. I think it's lovely too. Yes. Your voice is as much better than mine as Pudgeon's got huge. Yes. I agree with, uh, to add to the unanimous vote. Your voice is lovely, Sammy. Alright, Pudgeon's. Let's go take on the world. Let's go to that. Oh, cut up to y'all. Where y'all going? You're gonna let your friend leave you 
It will leave you in the dust. What happens if I stand in your way? Nope, you just go around me. What smart cats. That's so weird. Kitty, 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 kitty. Pajams. Look at that cute cat. Cat's nose is as big as my head. Ooh, a beach ball. Oh, that looks boring down there. This looks like uh, the main attraction. Okay. Hello there. Yeah, way more style than my character. You ever feel like a lighthouse? You know, Kai, I don't... can't say that I do. I wish cat, pet cats could get that big IRL. Hmm, that would be fun. God, the... Imagine the litter box and the food bill. It's not about pushing people away or pulling them in. You just have to stand tall, shine bright, and help guide whoever you can to safer shores. Well, you put it like that. I also like playing with flashlights in the dark. That's always fun. Have you seen Tiger King? Oh, goodness. Time for me to head out for the evening. Have fun corralling, corralling cat. I will. Thanks, Kelly. Hope you have a good rest of your evening. Thanks for coming. Must be the new cat cafe person. Cats like playing with flashlights, too. It's true. I don't reach Golden Grove. There used to be a bridge from here. But it got destroyed. Never got repaired. There's another entrance from Heart Village at the bottom of the hill where Autumn lives. There's a big hollow log. Oh yeah, I think I found that earlier. I think there was like a gigantic cat in it. Like even bigger than Pudgeons. Can you help me repair the bridge from the other side? Giant cat butt. I beg your pardon. Giant cat butt blocking the entrance. Oh. I know that butt. That butt is a troublemaker. Mm. Taken out of context, that can mean many things. I don't know what, where that giant cat came from, but it has been causing mischief everywhere it goes. Luckily, I'm prepared. Well, not fully prepared, but I have an idea. I ordered a special item from Estelle's general store. The flowers blocked me before I could get it. Be a deer and pick it up. I have preparations. Hmm. Nothing makes me happier than fetch quests. Should probably keep an eye on those business cats. Don't want those goofs hurting themselves. Oh, sorry, Pudgeons. I keep clicking the wrong button. The first. You want some pets, Pudgeons? Here you go. Aww, cute. Cute. Okay. Map. Where are we? We are... I think we're here. Yeah. And then... Is that... Is that the place? Ah, that is the place. What do I have to do? Go to Estelle. Mm, Estelle's general store. Can I go up this path? Oh my goodness, a horse! Can I make this horse an even bigger horse? Hmm, I must try. Come here. Come here. Come here. Oh, that was a big horse. Look at it. Shake, shake, shake. The horse's name is Horsey. Oh my god, what is that? Is that a skunk? What? Who are you? Hello. Oh, are you a ferret? Is that a ferret? I don't know my animals. This thing is weird. Okay. It got very quiet. <laughs> Bring Tiny Horse with you. 
Tiny horse is free for now. But later, maybe. Horsey the horse will come with me on an adventure. Okay. Let's see. A yellow bunny. Do, 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 do. Is that an orange bun? Okay, what are we getting? A special item from Estelle. I think you're Estelle, right? Yes. Darling, so good to see you. You too. Just came in off the island. Not every day someone needs a giant glass lens. So good to see you. Yeah, yeah. Well, what's up? Already have a cookie recipe. Cute bed. It's too cute to say no. Red bookcase, why not? A basic bookcase. <laughs> cute trash to go with my basic trash. I'm just get a little bit of everything. You know? Spooky trash. That's, that's my gender identity. Spooky trash. All right, let's go back to the lighthouse. Hello, bunny, right out of peeps. Glass lens, colonoscopy, yes. With a lighthouse. Very intense. Ooh. You're a very colorful, bunny. All right, we could take the stairs, or we could live dangerously. Good, we didn't get hurt at all. Didn't even hear a yelp from Pudgems. Okay, giant glass lens. How is this going to help me with the cat butt? Colonoscopy, yes. The connection. I'm going to head out. Love y'all. Love you, Maz. Love you, Chloe. Love you, Tipsy. Y'all are beautiful, gorgeous people who deserve good things. Aw, thanks, Sammy. You are the sweetest. Hope you have a good night. Uh, we got a giant lens. Yep, giant cat calls for giant lens. Oh. Oh, so we're gonna do a flashlight. Hey, Kristen. If that mischief maker wants to play, then let's play. I'll put the lens in the lighthouse, and then you take over the controls. Oh, fun. Is this where we're going? Let's destroy. Oh. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> what? What? Okay, it's a giant laser pointer. Well, that just happened. We thought Pudgems was the biggest. Yeah, I'm, I just have Pudgems Jr. <laughs> Apparently, that was Pudgems Sr. Where is Chloe from? I am originally from Florida, Mira. Okay, so I think this is where we're going, right? Giant log. Super uber pudgeons, yes. Oh, is that a doggy? Doggy. I don't like dogs as much, but you're cute. Boops. Shake, shake, shake. There you go. We, you get a, you get a front row seat to this dog. Look at that dog's face. It looks so happy. Why is this the button specifically for that? I mean, it's made for me. It's made for me. You're gonna be giant. I can't see. Where did I go? Okay. I feel like the camera got all weird. Okay. Is the camera- the camera's like really close to me. Um... How do I undo that? It's like 
all zoomed in on me. I don't want that. Hmm. I don't know what happened. Hey D, hey Kara. I meet up with all the great trans YouTubers. Aww. That sounds fun. And I appreciate I am making the assumption that I am a great trans YouTuber. I am flattered. Oh. Hello there. It's a cute dress. I'm gonna fawn over it. <laughs> Next week is Mr. Bear's birthday, and I make birthday presents for every animal in Golden Grove. Mr. Bear. And Gabby. Always remember to make animal presents out of edible materials, though. I went to a place called Tipsy's Dog Bar, and my cat, my mind's only red cat. I love that. You are one of the best trans students. Aw, thanks. Y'all are the best. Y'all are the best. Oh wait, you're not an animal, are you? Mm -hmm. I wouldn't be so sure. Either way, my uh, my name is Gabby. It's nice to meet you. Why is it so close? Oh yeah, mouse wheel. But how did I zoom in with the controller? Okay. Hey there, friend. Maybe I accidentally hit the mouse or something. Or maybe... Is it the touchpad that zooms? I don't know. Oh, it's the triggers. Okay, there we go. You're good with animals, right? Can I ask you for some help? Sure, what's up? Been feeling a little overwhelmed. Need something to help with the stress. Yeah, just have a drink of this beverage, and all your stress will go away. I decided that I want to get a pet. I'd love to have a furry friend to look after and play with. It's the best! Here's why I need your help. I'm gonna start with a dog, but I can't decide on what breed. Do you want a big dog, a little dog, something in between? Maybe something fluffy with a curly tail. Do I have a dog? I think I have one dog. Hmm. Are you fluffy with a curly tail? I do not remember. Um. Hmm. Trixie. You're going back to the cafe. I apologize. There's plenty of trash there for you, though. Party. Doggy, doggy, doggy. Hello. You're so cute. Look at this dog. How does this sound? Dog. Hey there, friend. I did the thing. How about this dog? What a cutie, but I don't know. Looking for a big fluffy dog with a cute curly tail. Sorry, can you try again? Oh, well, sorry, I see you've been rejected. Hey, Umbrella. Chloe, thank you for making the videos they do. It's been trying to help as I've started my transition. Aw, so glad to hear that, Umber. Always makes me happy to hear that somebody has helped with my videos, or my videos have helped somebody. I can talk. Tell Kai it was a success. And I don't, don't know if I've seen you in the live stream chat before, Ember, Umber, so welcome. I don't see any dogs. Boy, on the string. Okay, where are we? Oh, Daisy. Let's go talk to Daisy. Why am I not showing up on the map? Oh, there we go. <laughs> English. Are you a dog? You look like a dog. But you're not a big fluffy dog with a curly tail. You don't have a tail. Which is fine. But you'll be rejected. And let's avoid that. Hello, Daisy. Squeak. <laughs> Sorry, you startled me. I don't get many visitors deep in the woods, let alone here in deep woods, let alone a new person. My name is Daisy. Pleasure to meet you. I've heard so many good things about the cafe, but I've never been there. I have nothing against cats. Mm, sure. Something about them makes me uneasy. 
Oh no, you can't go there. There's a giant cat guarding the entrance. It's out there sleeping. Menacingly. <laughs> Nothing I can do to help you. The world is so big and I am so small. I mean, the cat is so big, that is. Rose is the only one that lives in Witching Woods, but there's no way for us to contact her with that cat in the way. Autumn used to live in the Witching Woods. Go, she, she knows how to get in. No. Cool. I... Got another quest without even realizing. Okay, let's go find a big floofy dog. Floofy, floofy, floofy. What are you? Oh, you a, you a pig? You a boar? I need to pick you up. I must pick you up. Pick up. Hello. What is your name? Do you have a name? Oh. Your name is Boar. That's so sad. They couldn't give you a name. Unless you're just Boar the Boar. Kitty cat. Kitty 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 cat. Kitty cat. Okay, so we need to talk to Autumn. But first, I guess that's where the bridge is at. Oh, a fox. An actual fox. Not the red panda that I keep thinking is a fox. Come here. I want to be your friend. Why do I run so slow? That's a noise. Whee! Alright, that was fun. Back to Pudgems. Must have the biggest amount. Or is the bridge fixed? Oh. You fixed the bridge. Cool. Happy fox noises. So what exactly is this game? That's a great question, Umber. <laughs> it is Calico. Where uh, we're in a world where there's a bunch of animals. I am the proprietor of the local cafe filled with cats. And we do little missions. To help the island be successful. It's a cute disguise for capitalism. It worked! Wow, really, I mean, of course it worked. Didn't doubt it for a second. I mean, we could see from the light, light, lighthouse that it worked. Take this laser pointer toy. Ooh. I wonder where the cat ended up, though. You should, you should probably head to the Golden Grove and see. Big solution. Yay, achievement. The controls on using the toys is awful. And they immediately stop. <laughs> okay. Oops. Actually, Tipsy, you always need some love. So let's go to Autumn, the secret of the witching woods. Mostly, Chloe shakes the cats. Correct. We need Nessa here. She's a furry expert. Or Riley. <laughs> this game is adorable. It's very, it's very repetitive, and the mission, and the quests are not that exciting. But the game world is adorable, and it makes it worth it. <laughs> Okay, so we're gonna go talk to uh, Miss Autumn. Looks like she's in her little glass bulb. Will you be playing Life is Strange True Colors? I want to. I haven't pre-ordered it yet. That was money. I was waiting to see if they'd release like a special edition physical version, because they did that for all the other Life is Stranges. My only concern streaming it is that it has a, uh, I'm assuming, based on all the other games, that it has tons of uh, licensed music, which can be annoying to stream. So maybe that could be like a special Discord only treat, you know, just an incentive for everybody to join the Tipsy Army. Hello there. Oh, did you turn into a cat? 
Greetings, traveler. Ah, wonderful. Witching Woods, yes. I used to live there. It's a beautiful place overflowing with chaotic magical energy. Living there can be a bit exhausting, though, which is why I scooped up my house in a magic bottle and moved it here. Oh, so you shrunk your house and then... I'm assuming. My sister Rosa still lives there. I miss her. I should visit soon. How do we get in? There's a tree door in the north. Oh, I think... I think I remember seeing that. Usually sealed to keep the magics from getting out. And the only one who can open it right now is Rosa, who's currently on the other side. So we need to ride the magic, the giant cat, and jump over the wall. Cleared the way to Golden Grove. There's another entrance from there. Giant sleeping cat. Aw, beans. <laughs> Should probably figure out what it's doing there. Kitty that size could have only come from the witching woods, and now it can't decide if it wants to go in and out. What do you think it wants? What do we think? What does the giant cat want? To hunt? To hunt, to play, to eat. I'm gonna say to play. Join the tipsy army, we have loads of fun, yes. Yes, you know, just another plug, the uh, Discord can be found through the Patreon if you go to the description down below. And it can help Tipsy and I eat. Hmm. <laughs> We talk a lot and make each other hungry with food pictures. Yes, lots of food pictures, lots of memes, lots of animal pictures. Yeah, because I definitely want to play the new Life is Strange game, so maybe to get the full experience without having to silence the music. I could have, like, a private stream through there or something. I don't know. Maybe private, private Jackbox streams in the future, too, because I know a couple people mentioned wanting that. All scored join us all right everyone what do we think what does the big cat want to do it's a good pitch i'll need to check it out yes please i'm gonna go with to play of course it's been bored everybody has been too afraid to play with it poor lonely kitty oh interesting face not just any toy will do, though. We need something big, full of enough magical energy to entice them. Magic is like the catnip to magical cats. Hm. Didn't know that, did you? I've got it. We'll get a big plush mousy and infuse it with all the magic we can get our hands on. A giant kitty will require giant magic, though. <laughs> I feel like we're just making this up as we go. Way more than I can do by myself. This island is full of people that can help us out, though. Just take the mousy to each of the witches and have them imbue it with some of their own brand of magical energy. Oh, look at that cute little mousy. Start off with a dash of Autumn's patented magic juice. Don't worry, it doesn't smell that much. Gross. Gross. Oh, yep, there's a wall there. I forget, because the wall disappeared. It's okay, Tipsy, I'm coming. Okay, so we need to go to Ash, Autumn, Estelle, Lumi, and Shin. Um, so let's see, where is each person? So there's nobody over there, so I guess that's the magical woods, I'm guessing, by all the psychedelic crap. So Kai, so we got... Uh, Lumi, where's Lumi? Oh, let me- oh, damn, I have to go all the way up there. Ash. Where's Autumn? Oh, I already got Autumn, yeah. Ash is still- okay. So maybe we can go up to the snow mountains first. Yeah! I have an accidental ninja that pops in from time to time. <laughs> There's so many crimes. Ever since we played, uh, what was it? Night in the Woods. <laughs> if anybody has recommendations for other games that are like that, let me know, because that seemed to be one that everyone liked. Do, do, we're gonna skip sleep, it's getting dark, but who needs it? Tipsy can stay up forever. Oh, so we gotta go all the way up. This better be good, Lumi. 
Got to scale a mountain for your magic. <laughs> so calm, so peaceful. Am I going the right way? The ultimate question. I think so. Going to the hot springs. These clouds look magical. That one looks like a hand. Did we leave all the other animals behind? Oh, no, there's Pudgeons. Pudgeons and Batches. And Giant Bunny. All right, Lumi. Give me your magical juice. Where are you? I need your magics. Okay, looks like you're down. Oh, there you are. Hold tight, Tipsy. I'll be back. Hello. I hope you're doing well. Magic Mousy. Oh, this is fortunate. I made some catnip scented bath bombs, and everything I own, including my magic, smells like catnip at the moment. That is super convenient. Uh, since you run the cat cafe, it must be great with animals, right? Do you think you could round up some of my one of my children for me? I don't know. I don't, I don't, uh, sorry, you gotta find somebody else for that job. Okay. I'm just doing the main quests. Okay, I think this is the uh, probably the direction we want to go in. Maybe, maybe. Oh no, oh, there we go, and we're going. I almost thought I landed in a spot I wasn't supposed to land in. Okay, we did it. Catnip tea is good for incubating dreamy sleep in humans, too. Oh, interesting. <laughs> yep, new channels, more new people. Yep, the Discord has grown. I think we have uh, over 30 people now in the Discord, so that's a nice little community. Okay, let's go talk. Where's all the music? It's so quiet. Oh, we get cat town music. Woo. Oh my goodness. Look at that. That cat's got some skills. Can I talk to any of y'all? Can I pick you up? Okay, here we go. Here we go. Yeah, I can dance too. Go, Tipsy, go. God, that cat. How's that cat? How's that cat not stopped yet? Right, I think I need to talk to you. Get some of your mushroom magic. Oh my gosh, magic mousey, a giant kitty, and you want to scare it away? I want to get it home. Been meaning to visit. Or go hug the giant kitty when I get home. Thanks. Thanks for the magic. Alright, Pudgems, your turn. Nope, oh, I guess it's Patch's turn. So we need to get Ash and Estelle. Come on, Patches. Come on, Patches. Yeah, that's how, that's how physics works. It's one of those forever spin cats. Area reminds me of the Lich King expansion. Is that a, is that World of Warcraft? Oh my, it's like I'm falling through the ground. Patches, don't disappear on me. 
Okay, Ash and Estelle. Like, Ash, give me your magic from the chat. Here we go. Hello there. Sup? You need a magic mouse to trick a giant cat? Say no more. I'll add a bit of spooky magic in case the cat likes it spicy. Spicy cat. Alright, Estelle. It's up to you. Where'd that giant, that big walking cat go? Let's talk to you. Let's see, you got any, got any fun, fun uh, sketchy wares to sell me? Oh, you have a lot. Oh, donut recipe. Cream puff. Wind up penguin. Chewy gummy. Pressed. Oh, it's a toy. Sloth toy. A muffin recipe. A Mr. Moosey. Wow, you have all the goods. Turn yourself into a cat? Absolutely. Why, why didn't I get that sooner? <gasps> that is kind of horrifying, but I love it. I'm a cat. Here we go. Why? Okay. Hey, Emma. <laughs> Darling, so good to see you. Oh, you recognize me through the cat magic. So good to have all the witches working together. Looks like we're ready to go. Okay, we got cat on cat. Bring the magical mousey to the giant cat. This game was made for me. This is really weird. Cats riding cats. Cats shaking cats. I wonder if I can control, like, what I look like in terms of cat. Hmm. Or is it random? Let's see. Let's try. If I turn into a different cat? No, same cat. That's eh, okay, the cat's tipsy adjacent. <laughs> Raising. <laughs> this has got to be one of the strangest games I've played. What critter is that? No, it's a cat. Okay, so where am I going? Where am I going? I am going, I assume, there. Is that right, right direction? Yeah. Cat. Look at that. Cat got tricked. Oh, are you a bear? Oh, you scared of the giant cat? I would be too. Pudgems is fierce and scary. Oh my, that cat is big. Do I get to ride this cat? Look how fuzzy it is. Hello. So do I got a magical mousy? A magical mousy. Here we go. You want it? Oh. Oh, this is what's happening. Oh, is that the end of the game? What? <laughs> okay. I assume there's probably more you can still do, but that that was that was sudden. Well, that's fitting that ending the game with a cat. <laughs> oh, thank you, Emma. Made me happy to see you pop in. <laughs> You pop in for the perfect Chloe game. Cats everywhere. Oh, I don't have to hold the button anymore. Okay, good. This this is like really close. Okay, there we go. Let's get a get a zoomed out look. This is chaotic. Oh, 
All right. Well, we still got a few minutes. We can see if there's anything else. Oh, one of the one of the people in the credits is Cat. <laughs> All right. Anything else? And then just zoom in. Look at those eyes. There's no soul in those eyes. I have infiltrated the Discord. Welcome to the Discord, Umber. <laughs> I was thinking, what are the odds the first game I see you play is a bunch of giant tipsies? The odds are probably good. The odds are probably good. <laughs> I'll have to find other cat-themed games. I'm sure there's plenty. Okay, um... We good? Can we can we move on? Can we move on? It's like, can we at least have the cat continue moving? I want to play in the giant mushrooms. Okay, well, this is fun. Oh, there we go. Why is there still more to do? <gasps> Look at that cat. Look at that cat, it's magical. Boots! Oh my goodness. Look at that cat. Wiggle! Alright. Let's, uh, we gotta make this cat big. Because, yes, we now have a galaxy cat. That is awesome. Come back here! I need you in my life. Okay. I'm gonna add you to my to my party. I have to pick you up and give you a command. Party is full, so who are we who are we dumping? Who are we dumping? I'll see you can go back to the cafe. Alright. You are mine now. Galaxy cat. Trippy kitty. Yep, the cat is mine. Hello, the shot to join on. <laughs> Do you join with uh, me in the cat's mouth, basically? Yeah. Welcome, Chewy. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Are you okay? I mean, I am a cat. Taught kitty not to bite people, but they must have really just wanted your toy. Giant cat is yours. I raised them since they were a giant kitten. Thought they're hiding from me lately, but I guess they got through the magic barrier. And so focused on perfecting flying magic. I've been I've completely ignored my poor sweet baby. Look at that, look at that galaxy cat. Just creeping in the background, knowing all the secrets of the universe. I'll never ignore you again, my good good baby. Flying magic, yes, that's the important part. Flying broomstick. Would you like to try it out? I need to collect as much test data. So I'm going to be a flying cat. Uh, you can keep it as long as you want. So I'm going to keep it forever. What? To use this potion to summon your broom friend. Promise it's safe. Okay. Whee! How do we fly? How do we fly? Look at that. I'm a real witch now. Suck it, cat. Oh. That's something you can do, apparently. Tell Mayor Kiva you've cleared travel for every part of the island. Yay! And thanks for having me. It's 1.30 a.m. in Ireland. And there's a heat wave. Oh. Well, stay safe. Oh. You look evil. Stay safe, Chewy. It's the broom sound effect of cat's purr. I think it is. Can we go faster? <gasps> it kind of sounds like a an engine crossed with a cat. Of course, we don't get this till the very end of the game. Okay, Marikiva. Hey, Frando. Cleared all the travel. I was joking when I asked you to do that. That's amazing. 
Oh wow, y'all are fast. Five thousand dollars, yes! Now everyone on the island can visit your cat cafe. Feel free to take a vacation and pet every animal you can find. At least that's what I would do. Alright. Is that the game? I have work left. Wife won't text me. Big sad. Oh. This game on Steam or Switch. I have it on Steam. But I think it is also on Switch. I actually uh, got it for free. The maker of the game gave me a key, so... Yay. Okay. Any what anything else that we gotta do? I mean I guess I have other quests, but turn capybaras. Basic display case. Alright, um I'm gonna turn back into a human. Where'd my broom go? There it is. Time to fly. Wee. I don't feel like doing all the side quests. Is there anywhere in the island that we haven't really gone to yet? No, not really. Cool. And crash into the wall, and we're back at the cafe. It's a new day! I never went to sleep. Oh, that's a friggin' mess in here. Okay. Can you customize the avatar? Yes. Sure, she might- wife might be distracted. Or watching a rad streamer. Aww. So he whines about wife not texting back, but never texted wife in the first place. <laughs> Drama. So uh, somebody wanted donuts, so we're gonna make so many ingredients. Flour. Sugar. I hate the sound that bear makes. You're a strange looking egg. Uh, we need some yeast, some butter. Is this how everyone cooks? Oil, vanilla, that's a lot of vanilla. I'm guessing your oil, I mean, yeah, of course you'd throw an entire container of oil to make a single donut. Look at that. It's a cat donut. Okay, we have donuts. Somebody wanted donuts, I don't remember who. Okay. So we can put a donut in the case. Whoops, no, I don't I don't wanna do it. Don't wanna do it. Stop. There we go. Okay, where is a donut? Donut. Here we go. Okay, we have donuts. Miss Kitty. <laughs> Miss Kitty needs to be shook. And this is what we're gonna leave on. Have you ever lift your cat up to help them catch bugs on the ceiling? I haven't done that. It's not a bad idea. Although Tipsy, I don't know if Tipsy would be, be game for that. I wish I could, like, turn my broom into a cat, and then have a flying cat. That would be great. They should have a potion for that. Oh look, I can shake my cat in midair. Cause that's how, that's how this works. Okay, Miss Kitty. Sleep is always a high probability of a rad streamer. <laughs> Oh, of course, the mountain's shaped like a cat. Why wouldn't it be? Wow, y'all know how to travel. Oh, 
Oh no! Okay. Ugh. Well, I think I I think I am done with Calico. That was fun. But you know, we completed the main quest line, which all it was was fetch this, open barrier, fetch this, open barrier, the end. <laughs> Wasted. <laughs> Favorite fictional cat? Mine is Garfield. I don't know who my favorite fictional cat is. I don't know, I like Salem from Sabrina. The old Sabrina, not the new Sabrina. The Salem that actually talks and is a horribly animated puppet monstrosity. Oh, look at that, that's, that's terrifying. Wants to steal my soul. Glad I caught the end of the stream. Oh, I'm glad you did too. Hey, Ellen. All right, everyone. Any uh, any thoughts on what we should dive into next? We can poll the audience. We can uh, you know, exit on some on some uh, calming music as you get lost in the cat's eyes. Look at that. Look and in, look into my eyes. Sounds fun to see me play Dark Souls. Oh, is that what we're doing? Pa patron co-op. Ooh. Patron co-op on Dark Souls? Inside. I, I've actually never played inside. Does puppy cat count? I don't know what puppy cat is. All right, so we got we got we got votes for Dark Souls. Vote for Inside. Any other thoughts? Uh, somebody said that Meowiwana. Dark Souls kicks my bit. <laughs> okay, so take a note of that. Ooh, Untitled Goose Game would be fun. I never beat that. That would be fun. So I think I got that on Switch. Okay, so Dark Souls, Vermintide, I haven't thought that yet. Not the Goose Game. <laughs> I mean, I'm feeling drawn to the Goose Game because it's obnoxious. Just honk honk. It's basically Asshole Duck Simulator. Asshole, asshole Bird Simulator. Cuphead. Oh god, I do not want to play Cuphead again. Cat, cat, cat. It's unbridled chaos. Yes, it is. It's like a game where you're a bird and your mission is to ruin everyone's joy. It's delightful. I believe you, like, you piss off a farmer, you make a kid cry, you steal somebody's groceries. It's great. Would provide nice streaming content. The Goose Game? Yeah. Like, Dark Souls would be fun. I don't know how exciting that would be for a stream. Maybe. Maybe. Oh, Mira, gotta feed the cats. See ya, Mira. Nope. Meow. What do we got? Give me your goods. Cloud table. That kind of looks terrifying. Ooh, rad cat throne. Absolutely, absolutely. Cloud table. Hair tie. Oh, that's cute. Okay. Pokemon Go. <laughs> gonna have a, a mobile live stream. Left for Dead, Worms, Zelda, Mario, Hoonie Pop. Don't know if I want to put my uh, channel on the level of Pony Pop. That just feels like awkward. <laughs> I did the thing. Cool. Give me money. Yeah. Ooh. Okay. I think the uh, maybe Untitled Goose Game 
and Dark Souls coming up next. We'll add inside to the list. I'll probably put out polls. I do want to, you know, see if I can find more, like, LGBT games, too. Can get overcooked on the Switch. Yes, I have, I have overcooked, too, on the Switch. And Kitty, Kitty go fly. Pokemon Snap. Ooh. If anybody wants to buy Pokemon Snap for me, I would gladly play it. <laughs> it's like I do want to play it. I just don't know if I can justify sixty dollars. All right. No. Shop. Oh, what is all this? Stop or start the clock. Oh, that's fun. Which toy? Set loose to fly around. Curious at. Oh, interesting. Power makeover. Dye your hair and make your eyes glow. Yes. Turn your hair into a cosmic void. Absolutely. Change animal to sparkling night version of itself. Oh, fun. Become an ice cream sundae. Why? But I'm buying it. Turns a bird into a griffin, or at least not the, or at least that was the plan. These potions are a nightmare. Okay. Ooh. My hair is a cosmic void. Oh, I like that better. That's what they mean by an ice cream sundae. All right, that's what we're doing. I like it. Let's go, let's go put a potion on my bird. No. How did the dance? It was amazing. Can't thank you enough. Whoa, congrats, second place, cool. Dancing against cats. Thanks. Ooh, disco ball. Okay, bird, where are you? I hear you. Oh, there you are. We're gonna turn you into a griffin. Inventory, potions. Come here, I have a present for you. There you are. I don't like that. <laughs> I don't like that at all. I'm sorry, Raven. Something went terribly wrong. Yeah, we can put you back to normal. So, turn you into Cosmic Knight. Oh. Interesting. Have you... Your dry delight? What is your dry delight? <laughs> oh, I want to see what Pudgems looks like in a galaxy version. Oh. Does everybody look the same? Turn back. Oh, so that... I thought that would be... Pageants. Pageants. Okay. Eh. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, so it just turns them all gray. I don't like that. That is boring. Alright, Disco Ball, what do you do? Dance. Oh, my eyes. I have no soul. Okay. We'll leave on that note. <laughs> the LGBT bartending game. Your dry delight. Oh, so like dry martinis. Whoever named that needs to be slapped. <laughs> I'm gonna make like a Chinese board game and go. I see what you did there. Good night, Chewy. Well, everyone. We'll go ahead and wrap it up here. We got some ideas. 
I've got some ideas for games. Looks like, you know, Untitled Goose Game, Dark Souls, Pokemon Snap, your dry delight. Um, yeah, um, I don't know. I agree with uh, Casey. I don't know how I feel about the name of that game. Let's make a note. I don't forget. Abzu is really pretty. Ooh. Aw, thanks, Ash. I'm glad you like the stream. Untitled Goose. Yep, Mega Notes. Because I will forget everything. Because <laughs> I will definitely. My brain will want to forget your dry delight. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Support the Patreon so I can buy Pokemon Snap. Alright everyone, this has been fun. We uh, conquered the world of Calico, and I am an ice cream sundae with fire eyes. This was, this was fun. I'll have to find another adorable game like this, another, another cat simulator. Alright, I will see y'all. Or you'll see me next Wednesday. Got lots of new videos planned, lots of new videos recorded. Don't know which one's coming Wednesday, but we'll, we shall see. But I will see y'all in the chat again next Friday, and I'll figure out a game in the meantime. Maybe I'll put out a poll with some of these choices. And yeah. And I still do plan on having that uh, ASMR channel at some point when I have, have time to actually to make it. Probably overthinking it. But it's fine. Just just look into my eyes. Look into my eyes. Get lost in those eyes that have no soul. Alright, on that wonderful note, I will see y'all soon, and I hope y'all have a wonderful rest of your night or rest of your morning. Before you leave, don't forget to give this a big old like, hit that subscribe button, all that fun stuff. Check out the Patreon, check out the rest of the channel insert other plugs for stuff I do, and yeah, you know, give a big thank you to our wonderful moderators. We had Casey and Zoe in the house. Give them some love, because they always deserve it. They're amazing. And yeah, hopefully see some of you in the Discord. Alright, everyone. Give you all a second to, uh, Read uh, Casey's wonderful comments. Don't forget to love everyone. Stay safe. Bye, everyone. Love you all. Tipsy loves you, too. Mm -mm -mm.